Everybody, welcome back to uh, the second episode of It's Bananas with Jeremy Fisher. I actually have somebody here with me this time, which I'm very excited about. Nicholas yes. Fernandez. Uh, you don't like me because I was supposed to be here for the last one. I do like you. That's why you're here now. Uh, well, I mean, we, we had a we had a plan and yeah. I didn't live up to it, and I feel bad about it. Oh, uh, no. That's all I'm trying to say. I'm, sorry. Yeah, I'm yeah. trying to apologize. I blame I blame my brother. Steve <laughs> uh, he said he was going to do it, and then he didn't. And kind of like push that back, but it's okay. It's in the past. It's all right. Uh, maybe, maybe you guys will see him one day um, on the show. But we will, we will see. We'll see about that. See if he's worthy. For now, I'm here. Show. Yeah. So yeah, Nicholas Fernandez, comedian, uh, accountant, yet actuarial, uh, actuarial. analyst. I, oh. Well, where I'm soon to be, hopefully, because I'm yeah. unemployed at the moment and job hunting. Oh, and uh, I hope my future employers don't see this. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I mean, with your, with your name everywhere, then I'm pretty sure they might. Uh, luckily, there's a lot of Nick Fernandez's. Yeah, um, I mean. And my, you know, it's not my legal name, so. That's good. Uh, it's my stage name. Fernandez which is or Nick? Nick. Oh. Because, yeah. yeah, they can't just be like, hmm, what could his, like, nickname be? Oh, my God, look, they just said it. Oh, uh, yeah. That, mm. I like just, how, just call I like, him back to my bits. <laughs> I, know, actually, I love how you did that. Yeah. Like I'm like this is this works. Keep doing this. Yeah, it's actually a really good. I didn't, I didn't. The funny part is like you convinced me to keep doing it. Uh, yeah, because I didn't find it, it funny. I thought it. I thought I it did was not hilarious. find it funny at all. Still don't that much. Uh, well, do but I, 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 I built. I built. Yes, every time I do See, it. I but I, I built. Uh, I built onto it like stuff that I like, yeah. and that makes me feel better about it. Mm-hmm. That's awesome. Yeah, so guys... Uh, uh, just so you know, the, the the bit we're talking about is that... Hi, I'm Nick Fernandez, and uh, as a child, I was confused by the term nickname. <laughs> I didn't laugh, he did, but, like, I, I hope you did. I hope yeah. you did, because... Because uh, it's just... It's those, it's those small things that yeah, really... Yeah, it's, it's so little, but, like, I, I just, don't know. Maybe it's, it's not, like, my the stuff I write is not... Even, some of the stuff I write isn't even in my taste. It's yeah, hilarious. That's all right. That's it's funny. Yeah. You're making it because you're, like, you're trying to connect to other people on this level, and if they all find it funny, then it's just, like, you've connected yeah. in a way that's just, like, oh, I didn't know this would work. Luckily, I listen to enough, like, comedy podcasts that I know that, like, other comedians feel this way. Yeah. That they don't uh, find some of their own stuff funny, and they don't get why people are laughing. yeah. You gotta realize you have to like shout out to Burt Kreischer. That's <laughs> why so you gotta like videotape your stuff and like yeah. understand that you have to. Uh, you definitely have to do that. And and like when I've done that, when I film like myself with a video, like I realize that like some of the laughs aren't not what I say, but the yeah. face I'm making. Yeah, as exactly. I say it. Like you have to look at also like what what you're doing when you're yeah. on stage because if you're not looking at what you're doing, it's just like you're just gonna be still there. Or you're like you're gonna be pacing around too much. Like you have to find your find your style. I've yeah. been trying to like play with a, a few a few different ones like you know that hold like hold onto the microphone stand one or like the um, Dave yeah. Chappelle like just hold your stomach like I I, I, I did I Dave Chappelle uh, probably two or three weeks ago uh, at uh, at a at a mic in Richmond Hill yeah and uh, I didn't even mean to but like I had I had just come off a string of doing like well on like six rows in a row yeah in like a week and a half mm-hmm. and I was not feeling comfortable with that streak so I went there to bomb yeah so I went up bullet. Sat on the stool, told like a two and a half minute story that ended up in a, in a, in a, it was a rape joke, but about like me and my friend getting raped in the same day. Yeah. So, um, but it, it was a very long walk for that. Uh, and, uh, and I, I, I realized at, like halfway through the set, I was sitting on, on, on the stool like, like this. And then I looked down and I was like, and I was like, had my fingers like this. And I was like, oh, I'm doing Dave Chappelle right now. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm oh doing God. Dave Chappelle. I was like, I might as well have been knocking the mic on my knee. Like, yeah. it was <laughs> hilarious. And, like, I didn't mean to do it. It's just, like, that's just what happened to my body as it happened. It yeah, was- yeah. I like that, though. Like, I love I love the, like, high intense. Like, I try to copy, like, Kevin Hart a little bit. Like, his movements, because he moves around a lot. And, like, he really, like, owns the stage when he's up there. Because it's just, like, it's now, really, like his it's last a, special theater in the round, yeah, too. Like, so he yeah, was just... Like, at, with that around. giant screen. Yeah. Yeah, because I saw him. I saw him as, at his Irresponsible Tour when he was oh, over yeah? here. And he did that exact same setup. Like, wow. he was inside, like, the middle of the, um, the uh, Scotiabank Arena. I saw the and, set uh, uh, Chris D'Elia record for his, uh, recorded for his last... I think Man on Fire. Man on Fire is the one where he talks about the the, the little girl with the oranges. I think so. Whichever one that was. Yeah, I, yeah. We, I saw that one live. And it was like, it was basically the exact same everything that was on the special. Yeah. 
couple changes here and there, but basically the same thing. Yeah, I think that's what they like. That's what they do, though. Like, yeah, they just, yeah. They just copy it from wherever they're going. That's why they don't get any. Well, the, I, I'm, I like. I mean, the the way I, the reason I say that is like I was happy I saw it in like its best form. Yeah, yeah. When you're seeing it, yeah. When you see it live, like it just like when you see it at the beginning of someone's tour, it might be completely different yeah. than how the tour ends. Right? Yeah, yeah. And like they always have like the intro of like talking about like where they are. Yeah, which is really which is definitely really interesting. And like it's some um, it's something that's really cool to pick out. In, yeah, uh, when you're watching other people's specials, but I like I like Kevin Hart and I like how he's just like really just so energized and I'm like oh fuck I want to be like that I want to be like really energized and like have that kind of like energy when I'm on stage. I yeah, ended up, I ended up doing that at the Hot Box on th- like this past Thursday. Brought a little bit more energy to my uh, sets. I ended up like creating a couple new jokes like on the spot just because I was just like I felt so good about it. And like one go? Thing, it was really good. Like I got a lot of laughs. People loved it. Um, I was actually surprised. Awesome. So, yeah, yeah, it was really good. And um, that's a that's a four twenty show, right? Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. So people uh, are like people are all smoking outside. And it's like there's like <laughs> did, some. Did tr- you did you have this uh, this experience that when I've done those shows that they laugh? There's a delay on their laugh. No, it was there's no delay. It's like people people were like pretty attentive because there were some pretty good comedians that that went up on there. Oh okay. Well, mm-hmm. like the ones I've like done just because people have been like so I think so big because like they they laugh. It takes them a second to for to process. Yeah, what they're hearing. Yeah, yeah. So there's like probably like a. That's why it's you, it's not long. It's like it's like a two second delay. Yeah, but you gotta like you gotta target your material to what you're going into. Yeah. If you don't target that, then it's just like you're not gonna get what you want from it. Yeah. So you gotta understand. It's just like okay, you gotta take a little bit longer with uh, with with stoners because they need to like process all that information, and so you gotta like. Yeah, you, be a I, bit I just slower. ended up having to lengthen my pauses. Yeah. Like. Um, you know, not not like moving on to the next thing right away. Just yeah. letting the the space breathe and the, and then trusting that the laugh would come. Yeah, and like yeah, if you, you definitely gotta check out like where like where you're performing because like some of the shows that I perform, like I do some, like the same jokes in like different areas of Toronto, and like and there are certain areas where it's just like oh yeah, the, these jokes kill, but in like a different area, it's just like ooh, like why'd you say that? And like it's very interesting how it's just like it's so like diverse. Like you can say it over here, but you can't say it over here because people like people don't care about it there. Like, yeah. do you find that? Like, you're finding that at, like, some clubs? Like, even when I go to, to like, Durham Region, like, you can talk about well, these kind of things a lot I mean, more. I mean, the thing because I found it to be pretty universal. The farther you get outside the city, the dirtier they yeah, want you to be. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> they don't give a shit. Like, they're not so, like, oh, my Oshawa, God, I'm so they're, offended. Oshawa, they're like, bring it. I know. Like, even, even on my Oshawa show, like, I was just like, oh, hi. Like, it's nice to be in Oshawa. I'm like, wait a minute. That's not right. Like, <laughs> I can't say nice. Like, Oshawa. Yeah. <laughs> And I'm like, you guys are so great. You have like how needle, many one way dis- streets are there? <laughs> they have like used needle deposit boxes like right by the library. They have them like everywhere. Um, I mean, I mean, how else are you gonna mark your page? But like, uh, you, you look at over here. Like, we don't. I don't. I've never seen one of those things. Like, we we reuse, recycle. You know, like yeah. you can't just throw them in on needle deposit box. Like, yep. I love it. I love it. It's, so. uh... What uh, what do we want to talk about on this show? Or is okay. it, are, are we doing it? Is this it? No, no, yeah, this is it. This we're is, doing it? We're doing the show. I mean, Th- we're already, This is the show. We're almost like 10 minutes in already, so this is the show. Oh, we're recording? Oh. How did you not know? You literally pushed the record button and said you were recording. <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I, I just, I, I wasn't sure if, the, like, if oh. this was it. Or if so, like, yeah, this was just like, this was the pre-show, you yeah. know? And then we have the after after show. Yeah, I was watching. Um, I wonder, I've been watching like a lot of documentaries. Yeah. Holy crap! Like I was watching this one about like the seventy two like dangerous animals and like in like specific like a specific continent. Oh, like, like it was BBC things. Yeah, it, yeah. It was like it was on Netflix, so I just like watched that when I was at work, and like it was like so many like you know that little like um, like uh, monkey kind of thing. It's like really tiny. But it's got like the cute little hands, like the big eyes and everything. It's like a lemus. Yeah. 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 So apparently, like those things are toxic. What? Yeah. Those things are toxic, and, like, they, the way that they fend off, like, people that are attacking them is to, like, they have, like, a sweat, like, comes under their armpits, so they, like, stick their, like, they stick their hand under their, like, into their armpits to grab the sweat, and they put it in their mouth, and that becomes a toxic, like, that's a toxic component. What? That's what they use against enemies. So that's if, nuts. So I found out that, like, when these, when these things are, like, these lemuses are, like, doing, like, tourist areas... Like, they're just, like, people, like, clip, like, they get rid of, like, everything so that they can't, like, attack tourists and use that kind of, like, natural defense. So they pretty much, like, torture these animals just for, like, tourists, like, amusement. Wow. Right? Would they, like, tie their hands or something? No, they wouldn't tie their hands, but, like, they would clip their, like, 
t- like their nails off and everything. Like, oh, and pull trim, out their like, teeth? Like, yeah, pull out their teeth so they couldn't bite. And, like, they wouldn't have, like, that capability of, like, creating that, like, toxin so that they can, like, attack their victim. Like, That's the, the people attacking. Because they just use it as a defense. They don't use it to attack people. Wow. Yeah. It's just, like, uh, the, all the stuff, like, it's bananas, like, all that stuff that, uh, that yeah. happens with, like, how do you feel about that? I mean, I, I, I don't know. Like, it's funny that you mentioned bananas uh, because we're talking about monkeys and stuff, like... Lemuses. 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 Well, I, I mean, I isn't lemuses. monkey like the the umbrella term for, or is it primates? Or? I don't. I don't think it's like. There's like a different. There's a bunch of different terms. I don't know. I, yeah. I don't remember my biology lessons at all. Yeah. Um, but something, something to look into. Yeah. I mean, I I don't really watch um, any documentaries unless they're about food, basically. Yeah. Just the the fat kid inside of me needs it. But needs food is it. delicious. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love cooking food. It's way better than like going out to eat. It's much more satisfying. Uh, I love cooking. What's your favorite thing to cook? Um, right now, um, probably like a nice pasta carbonara. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Actually, like probably my favorite thing to make uh, consistently that I could never get tired of is sandwiches. Sandwiches. Just a good sandwich, (laughs) man. Basic meat, lettuce, tomato. No, Um, no, 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 no. I caramelize onions. Yeah. I, I cook okay. a nice steak. I slice yeah. it up into no strips. I lay it on there with some sautéed mushrooms, mm-hmm. caramelized onions. Okay, so you make like a real, a real sandwich. I make a nice uh, dipping sauce out of mayo, hot sauce, a little bit of barbecue sauce, some smoked paprika, oh, nice black delicious. pepper. Mix that up. Sometimes a little bit of blue, crumbled blue cheese in there. Yeah. Give it a good toss. Throw that on the table. Take the sandwich, throw some throw some tomatoes on there as well, uh, close the bun, put it on a panini press. Drop that baby down, let it cook. Mm. Get a nice crust on there. You want to see the cheese bubble, but not quite come over the sides. Yeah. A little bit of grease comes out, and that's what you want. You pull it out, you slice it in half, dip that baby in the sauce. Oh, man. I really want that now. you got to make that for me. I, I definitely will. I, All right. I, I, I am happy yeah, we'll, to do that. We'll make that a, a day. Where you make that? We'll just you know have, like, what? We might make videos of you we, doing it. And no, just, like, you know finishing. what? Maybe we'll do it for a podcast. We'll there just we'll set it up in the kitchen. We'll get a couple different angles. There we go. Show the show show the whole process. You have to do like some slow motion, like how you're how you're doing it. Just, so it's just like that sizzling and like yeah the, yeah what, like, yeah. Doing the frying just the moment of the first then, like, bite. The, putting the sandwich together and then like putting the sauce in there. One hundred percent. All that in slow motion. You know, if we're gonna do that, I might have you up to um, my parents' place because uh, oh. big kitchen. Ooh. Big kitchen. Your parents' place must be yeah. fancy. It is. It is. It's. A, we got a hot I'm not, tub. I'm not gonna lie. Like I wish I was still living with my parents, but I can't. So like, yeah. like if you can, not like bedrooms. say no. It's not that. It's just like they, they ended up divorcing. Ah. But like I just, just I wanted to live on my own. But like living with parents, it's like you save a lot of money. Yeah. So it helps a lot if you have like any debt. So yeah. you might as, like it's good to it's good to do that and like pay off anything, save up enough for like a house. It was just like I was like yeah, I, I was eighteen like when I lived started living on my own. Really? Yeah. So oh, living on my own. You really are white. You yeah. really are white. Yeah. Right. Kicked out at eighteen. Yeah. I wasn't kicked out. I, 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 mean, I walked out. I'm like I can't deal with this. I mean that's the stereotype though, right? Like as yeah. soon as white kids start eighteen, they're out. No, no. I didn't follow that. I I walked out. Okay. I wasn't I wasn't fired. I quit. Okay. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> that's how this worked. <laughs> oh man, that story's just bananas. Um. Yeah, damn. Well, that's interesting. How do you feel about Trump? Let's talk about Trump. Um. Even though he's not a president. I, I mean, I I basically stopped reading the news and everything because everything's just so sensationalized. I sort of got tired of. I don't know. Call me uninformed at this point, but it's like it's just too much. I I, I yeah. don't I I don't need to have that in my head at all times. Like, uh, I even like tri- trickled off of watching Stephen Colbert because like I didn't yeah. want to know. Every day. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, it seems like a lot of... Like, even um, SNL, they do that a lot. They do a lot of, like, Trump stuff without, like, Baldwin. And, mm-hmm. like, people just love bringing him up so much. But if you just, like, stop talking about him, he'll eventually just disappear. Yeah. It's that whole giving someone a platform, basically. Yeah. Oh, man. Imagine if he wins in 2020. Oof. Uh, Oof. Yeah. Because, like, I'm pretty sure he's, he's going to go to jail if he... 
I mean, like if that, he doesn't, because like uh, isn't all that stuff what you done. keep hearing that like the, the the only reason he hasn't been indicted is because he's president and people don't want to set that president of like. Yeah, like why do they treat them like that? Like clearly this guy is guilty of so many things and he's clearly not fit to like rule the country. So like, why do you just keep him in in the country? Like why? Do it's you, weird because like you you don't even know what an impeachable offense is. Yeah, you can't even like impeach people because like there's like so many different like laws around that whole impeachment process too. There's a lot to think about. And like a lot of people just think it's like oh just kick him out. Yeah, it's like it's not it's not as simple as that. There is a whole process that goes towards it. Yep, like I and at this point I do know more about the U.S. P- political system from House of Cards and the news <laughs> oh and God. everything than I do about Good the Canadian old one. Kevin Spacey. Uh, I mean, touching. I, I, I would I, I would love to say I enjoyed that last season, but it's really not. I you, can't. You need that Kevin Spacey. I don't know. It, it was just a little bit. It was a little bit disappointing. Like, you did not live up to the rest of the seasons. I didn't, I didn't feel closure when that finished. Yeah. Do you ever feel that groups just, like, they happen for a little bit and then they kind of just, like, disappear? Like, the Me Too movement. Like, how's that going? I think it's it's Because, like, right now, like, right now, like, but it seems it's like, like the there's... climate change group is, is trying to happen right now. And, like, the no gun control. Like, that's a huge one right now. Like, a group. Because, like, they just focus on, like, one thing. It's just, like, because whatever takes more prevalence in someone's life... Yeah. So right now it's like gun control. Like let's focus on that, because they did get rid of like so many guys for that Me Too movement. Like so many women ended up coming forward and like just doing that. But then it's just like, do we do we even still hear about yeah, the Me Too? Yeah, I, I think like a phase? I, I think it's I think it's just gonna be here to stay. But like the the I think the there'll be more um, respect for its case by case basis, not like equating one end of the spectrum with a like a like a you know an actual assault and yeah. predator but then again like women still like women still like say like oh like they they say i sexual assaulted me like some some kids were the like, thing is like th- doing that too because they a can, lot they of media that they could get rid like can get away with like no a, lo- a lot of media is, i think has become like an echo chamber where yeah. it's like you're you're hearing the ends of the spectrum yeah right you're hearing the, the most extreme on each side and they're, and they're the loudest and they're the most vocal but like you're not like that's not everyone though mm-hmm. right and most people aren't posting their thought every thought and feeling most people are just focusing on their own lives yeah and so you don't need you're not gonna hear everything from everyone and so like you don't even know how everyone really feels because we just, uh, we just have it's, too just, much it's too loud. It's we too have, loud. We just have too much information. And Facebook and like Instagram and all these other platforms, they just give us all that information. I mean, how much? How many times a day do you just type in the the letter F in your in your browser and just check Facebook for no fucking reason? Right. Well, I just do that. I like honestly, I try to like like you gotta uh, what's discipline yourself when you go on Facebook. Like I just use it straight for like looking at like any gigs, any like comedy gigs, acting gigs. Other than that, like, I'm just like, no, I'm not taking part. I don't care what people have to say on Facebook. Like, like I'll, I'll look through it and, and see, but I really just use Facebook just for just for looking for comedy stuff. But, like, most of my attention is, like, really just on Instagram just because I'm trying to, like, reach out to more people. And then um, more people using Instagram on a consistent basis. Yeah, well. exactly, because it's easier and you don't have to, like, read what people are writing. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's more just, visual. It's all, it's all pictures nowadays. Nobody wants to, nobody wants to read. And videos. Yeah, pictures and videos. That's it. We're visual people. Do you follow Gary Vee? I do. I do watch Gary Vee a lot. He's a lot. Yeah. He's really he's really good. He's good, but he's just... He's a lot. Yeah, <laughs> he is. Yeah. But, like, that's that's the kind of mentality that he gave himself. And he's just like, this is, this is a winning mentality kind of thing. This is me. Yeah. I mean, Tony Robbins is the same thing. Like, do that's you watch bullshit. Any, do you watch that, any... That's bullshit. <laughs> do you watch any, like, Tony Robbins stuff? No, like, no, I, I don't really... That guy's intense. Yeah. Yeah. Just want to make sure it's still <laughs> gone. Well, we were talking when we were doing this. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I can see the little squiggly lines. Yeah, so the squiggly that's, lines. That's, the I, like, I like the, the squigglies. Yeah. The squigglies. Uh, it, 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 I don't know how I feel about when I laugh, like, it hits the edges. You yeah. know? <laughs> uh, it's a lot. Yeah, because yeah. you have a really uh, out there laugh. Yes, it comes from deep. Yeah. I love when people have, like, very distinctive laughs, and you're like, why do you laugh like that? Like, yeah, I think mine falls into that category of distinctive. Right. Uh, it's kind of the, it's uh, yeah, it's not even like I don't think it's anyone in my family's laugh. 
It's, it's just uh, like your own. I, it's kind of like my dad's, but I but yeah. a little bit like. Well, I think everyone no everyone just like develops their own like personal like based off of like what they see. As they're growing up, they see laughter and they're like, oh, I gotta kind of like mimic this. Like, ha ha ha. That's my my really dad's laugh, it. he goes, uh, If you ever see me, I don't have a laugh because nobody laughed in my family. Really? I'm, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I kind of like suppress most of it. <laughs> yeah, my dad's laugh is like, uh, it's like a, ha 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 ha. But like sometimes it's like sounds a little bit forced because yeah. he just he goes like, Oh, okay. And he does like this this clapping thing. He, he's like one of those dude. like I got I want to show you like how much yes. like this made me laugh. Yeah, yeah. He's he's a good dude though. Versus like you have the people that just say LOL in their mind. Yeah, <laughs> like they're just blank face like LOL. I I that find that at comedy shows like I hardly like I, I'm a generous laugher, but sometimes like I it doesn't I don't feel like it that do you, day. Do you laugh at your own stuff? Oh, of course. Yeah, of course. I find it's like fun. I I I would only I only say it if I still find it funny. Yeah. Like well, like gotta, s- some jokes gotta, like I, I haven't done it. in months. Yeah. Because like I I got tired of them. Like yeah. and then I I want to let the it, them breathe enough that I can come back to them and be yeah excited about them. Yeah, you have to believe in them in the stuff that you're saying. Yeah. Too, if you don't believe in it, no one else is gonna believe in it. Yeah, I mean, and, and I find that like. I'm not like a monotone, or I, I'm trying to be more conversational. I'm trying to be myself. You're trying on to be stage. yourself. Yeah. I'm trying to be. I'm like a, a lot of people do like a different voice. Like they're yeah. on the off stage, like they're they, really oh soft, yeah, yeah, and like, then they go on they stage, have, like, the character. completely different. Yeah. Um, I'm just trying to bring who I am right now. Yeah. Or like when I'm talking to my friends at dinner, like over wings, like and we're joking around and we're, yeah, we're yeah. just uh, that's what I making like fun it. of each yeah. other, right? Like that's what I want to bring on stage. Just yeah. that that presence and like I, I just it's gonna take time for me to just be consistently in my voice not like let the situation make me like these are the words that I wrote like yeah. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, don't you gotta, I gotta bring a personality out there yeah yeah it's crucial like look at anybody if you look at any like celebrity they have a they have a defined personality and yeah that's what they're going for and like a lot of them live that life because it's just like that's the personality that they've given yeah, a hundred percent. So you gotta find like you gotta find your personality. If you're just gonna be up there being all monotone, like thinking up thinking up jokes, then you're a writer. Yeah, yeah, and and, and, and that's what I'm trying. To, uh, like I, I I'm still in the space where I'm funnier off stage than I am on stage. Yeah. And why is that? I, um, just because I'm loose off stage. Like yeah. I'm I'm just loose, and like uh, when I'm on stage, sometimes it can get to like I'm. I'm performing the jokes. Yeah. Rather than like, like let's Tell talk them. about this. Yeah. Let's 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 do well, let's man, go create through. create it like a story. Like you're talking, yeah, you're and that's what I'm trying story. to get back get get consi- like. Yeah. I just want to make it second nature, and that's just gotta get the reps in. Like yeah. I gotta just you know do do my time of getting better, mm-hmm. and that's all I need to to focus on. And like that's all, that's all we can do. I mean, we're starting this. Hopefully, this is. Like we, uh, hopefully we, we get super successful at this and oh, like no. people are, like this people is, are, this is actually like why people, I this. like what I think is like, I, I'm trying to be prematurely nostalgic yeah. about things. Like mm-hmm. I want to try to be nostalgic about right now I in know. the moment. I know. Like, I, like, I'm and, exactly so like, like, I'm like, and so I'm thankful it. of what I'm doing in the moment. So yeah. like what I'm thinking is like, I'm looking at this camera, like there's going to be people watching this that, yeah, that, like 10 that, years. that, that, are, that, 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 this right. might be on a different pra- platform than YouTube. It right. might be on the new thing. It might oh, be on some yeah, hologram. No. People are going back to watch so us I really want when that. we were coming out. Oh, I really want when that. When we, 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 we were young and we, like, this in this stage of life, yeah. we're going to be 40 and people are going to be watching this. And well, like, this is like where they started. 37. I have, like, a 10-year goal. And I want to yeah. be, like, fucking up there when I'm, like, 37. I'm, like, this is where I want to so be. So you're These 27 are... right now. Yeah. Oh, so like you're I'm old as fuck. I'm turning 27 in November. Oh, man, you're so old. I'm so old. What are you, like, 12? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm five years younger than you? Wow. What? Oh, my God. Sit. God, yeah. I wish. I I'm, wish. A 90, I'm a 96. Oh, my God, you're so young. Yeah, but I'm a, I have a December birthday, so. Wow. Yeah. You're yeah, the same so I'm, age I'm as, 22. Same age as Kristen. 22. Yeah. Same age as my girlfriend. That's hilarious. Yeah. You're so young. Oh, my God, I wish I started it. When, um, when I, I wish was, I wish I started earlier than I did because like I I, I, I I wrote out my first bits like two years before I started. Trust me, like I, I wish and I went to Pedro wrote, O'Brien's and I, I and I, I chickened out. Yeah, I went to I I wrote my first bits when um, I was applying to Humber College in 2013. That was when I was like 22, 
Because I was like, like at their Humber College, like wow, comedy, so comedy you ready lot, You have five years of regret. I have five years of regret. I'm like, why didn't I do this five years ago? Like, this is what I wanted to do. I was going to, like, I was thinking about going to Second City. I wanted to take, like, all their, like, stand-up classes I'm, and all I'm that. I'm auditioning um, for Second C- City Conservatory Program on Are Thursday. You? That's awesome. Oh, yeah. my God. Yeah, I'm, I'm Good nervous, luck on that. I'm Good luck on that. Yesterday, do, yesterday I did two, 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 uh, two shows yesterday of, of two-man improv for an hour. Oh, man. It was interesting. It was not an ideal location. Um, there was the, people were throwing axes to our right, so every like every thirty, every like fifteen seconds, thunk, thunk, like h- loud. Yeah. Like and like there, it was long tables that were far away, and uh, there was maybe like for the first show there was maybe six people paying attention. Yeah. And for the second one, twenty, uh, and it was just not great. Um, location for improv not a great environment but it was a show we worked um, it was two me and me and uh, it, me and my uh, my friend Magda uh, the name of my pro, uh, improv group yeah you want to hear it yeah what is it the probiotics <laughs> why the probiotics because giggles are good for your gut oh my god <laughs> You like yeah, it, eh? Yeah, yeah you, you like cute. it. Yeah. That's cute. Yeah, yeah. That's, I, am, uh, I can't wait to see that. Yeah. Um, the first idea I had was, uh, and this really broke me. I like, cried when yeah. I found that, that I couldn't use it, was uh, the Unscriptables. Oh, man. There's a group in Sweden or, I mean, or Switzerland yeah, or something. Yeah. You got to think. And they've got like, like 20 followers on Instagram. <sighs> I mean, like, you might as it's well. It's taken. It's well, you, taken. You might as well. Like, if they're not doing anything with it, like... Well, you know, but you know what? They, you know what? Like, it's just... No. It's like when you see someone with a bit that's, like, got a similar premise to the, something you wrote down, I'm, I don't even bother doing it. Why? Because it's like... I, People, if they, they, if they could come up with it, I don't want to do it. Because, like, no, you I, can, wanna, you have, I want it to be my bit. No, but you have a different perspective on I, it. I understand, but, like, I want... Have, the the like, bits I'm, I want to write are... I'm sure are, you would have a different perspective of, like, talking about fleshlights. Like, I've... Like, I, I masturbate, and I want to just, like... I want to buy a fleshlight because yeah. I'm, like, I'm tired of using my hand. Like, I don't want to use it anymore. Like, yeah. I want something else. Well, like, I want that I, smell I of silicone I all the time. I don't see my girlfriend, like, all the time. So, I'm, like, I got to fill in the gaps. Would like, you... Uh, if you got a fleshlight, do yeah. you have one? I don't have one. Okay. I want to so, get but one. But d- if you had one, would yeah. you, like... Would you, like, wedge it in between, like, the box spring and the mattress and then, like... No, I just... And, like, sex your... Be- so I, I, see, I wouldn't want to do that. Like, like, like a, you know? But, like... like uh, I, it'll just feel better. Like, have you seen those, like disembodied torsos like uh, where it's just like it's just a mound and it's got like orifices the, oh yeah like the butt like yeah, the moaning yeah. butt I've seen that like yeah. why like it's just a butt like it, it's I, just I, like a I butt mean, with the with the butthole and you have the vagina you can fuck either hole I, I mean and it I, moans I, I, I have a I hard went, time I have a hard time like like taking myself to dinner when there's a mirror like I have a hard time cause like you just you just see your sadness yeah. you just you see it cause it's just like uh this is this is what this is it. This, this is, is what, it. <laughs> like even though it's a natural thing, I'm not ashamed of it. But it's just like this is what's come to, eh? Like, and it, it happens very often. But well, like, like well, when there's a mirror, it just it highlights for you what what your life is like at that moment. Oh, it's that's, uh, a, that's a fun life. Should uh, keep it up. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You, you definitely. have some dates coming up that you were telling me about before. So at least that's something excited in your in your life. Yes, I. Um, I, uh, well, tonight uh, I'm popping over to Einstein's Pub as soon as we wrap this up, um, doing an open mic there mm-hmm. in that beautifully shaped room. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, just, uh, just the most ideal conditions for comedy. Um, but you get what but, you pay for. Uh, yeah. It's free. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do we get a drink at that one? Yeah, they give yeah, me a yeah, we got a drink. Okay, so, so maybe I'll get a beer. They encourage maybe your maybe alcoholism. I'll, maybe I'll feel better this is about why myself. I'm going to get a nice pint. Uh I had a. It's, it's been a good day. I feel good as a, as a, as a creator that we're putting this out there. Mm-hmm. Um, this is my second podcast. Oh um, yeah, yeah. What that I've ever recorded. Yeah, 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If you yeah. Want to just... Oh, Matt, like not that you're bitter, but <laughs> not... <laughs> I just like bringing it up so you know. Uh, so you know. So you know that. that... I, uh, so I know. So you know. So yeah. I, know. I like I like yeah. letting people know. Like my buddy Will, if he listens to this podcast, he owes me twenty bucks. Uh, just so he knows. Put it out there. Put just it, so he knows. It, he said oh, he was okay. actually gonna like e-transfer me the other day when I told him about it. And I'm like, no, no, don't worry, because he has like a bunch of car payments to worry about. So I'm like, don't worry about it. Like, you do worry you, about your car payments. Do you don't have to pay me this twenty bucks back. Do you listen to a lot of podcasts? Um, um, like I listen to, uh, I've been listening to like a lot of Joe Rogan. Right yeah, now. but like, so, so you'll understand these bits. Like the, the this like this this thing I noticed. Like, since we're in Canada, most of the ads don't apply to us. Yeah. Like like Venmo or like the Cash App, not in Canada. So like like I was trying to write a bit about this. Like where like like it d- didn't work. But like where you um, you 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 hear something and then you're excited um, and then you go check the the app store and, or whatever and then yeah. you go to see if you can get that product or, or service yeah. and it's not available in Canada and then yeah. you're just like your world like falls a little bit like, why? Like you were why why can't it be available in Canada I hate that like some of my deals like uh, from I'm my, sure Venmo because like our regulations are a little bit more strict maybe but I have like benefits for my for the job that I work at. And they have been like the, the like it's a U.S. company, but they also like have a company like here that they bought yeah. it. That's called Stereo D. So like their benefits that they have for like the whole company, which is deluxe. Um, they have stuff like that you can get in the U.S., but they also have stuff that you can get in Canada. And the stuff that's in Canada is like garbage. It's just like car rentals and like hotel mm-hmm. deals. And I'm like, I don't want that shit. Like in the U.S., they have like, oh, save like a bunch of money on buying a new car, or, like save money on like buying a new house. Like what? 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 Why? Why don't I get that option? Like, I want well, some money if I want to buy a house. That's just a slap like, in the face, right? All I get is like just because of all the bears we have up here right? and the um, igloos, the polar bears, the, yeah. so many polar bears. No, but like, it's not the polar bears. Like, what I worry about is like you know the brown here. bears that we see. They're on like every corner here, right? Brown bears. I've never yeah, seen I mean, just go with it, you oh. fucker. See, you don't do that no, much improv. You, no, you don't like. Don't don't say no to me. I know. You take I, what I say and we build on it. Trust me, I haven't I, done this in I, so long. All I wanted was someone in the UK or Australia to believe and go and tell it's their friends so that there are brown bears on every corner in Toronto. I feel like that's so hard to do nowadays because everyone has the internet. So no, they can no, just... but like, I, I, there are still people who hear things and don't question them, and those <sighs> are the people. I love you. Don't change. No, those people aren't. Don't on the change. In, they're not on no, the internet. Because they're, no, because they're they, they, talking they, like they Trump will, or whatever. They <laughs> will. They will take the information that uh, that we put out there as truth, and we. It's never anything important. We're not going to so, lie to you like that. They, they're going to take it, uh, and they're going to go to their their, their friends. They're going to bring it up in conversation. Just lie to they're going to look. I, I I this is like a long a long joke you because know? like I want them to take this information to into a situation, bring it up as fact, and yeah. just. Have people you just, shut you, them down. Oh, okay. I yeah. thought you just wanted to like start like a huge trend that just like scares the shit out of everybody, and like you just be, wanted to be the one that starts. Because how do no, trends start? Like one person. No, starts like it and then I'll, I'll, I'll give you an example of something of something that, that I mean that is hilarious. Like, um, and it, it like this is kind of like what I want to do with the brown bear thing, but okay. like in a longer term. Okay. Well, I had a cousin from Italy come to visit mm-hmm. visit, uh, visit us. We went to the mall. We were, I believe it was Yorkdale mm-hmm. and we were walking around and then she was just like, oh my God, it's shut up. She has a very high voice. That's, it's, that. it's, it's, it's an uncanny. Do you, uh, impersonation. That at night? No, I don't. I don't. Just, just to myself to go to sleep. Oh, okay. Um, but I, uh, I, I, she was like, she was like, oh my God, you guys have H&M. And I was like, what? She's like, hey, H&M. H&M. I'm like, oh, wh- what? What? And then she's like, hey, H&M. And then um, I was like, I, I looked where she was pointing. Uh, and she was pointing at uh, the, a sign that said, the letter H, ampersand, M. Mm-hmm. Right? And then I looked H&M. at it, I, I, and, I, like, and I was like, oh, you mean hmm? <laughs> oh my God. And she was like, oh? I was like, you mean hmm? Yeah. Oh, you guys call it H and M in in Italy? And she's like, Yeah, H and M. And I was like, um, No, we call it hmm here. And then my 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 cousin was walking like my cousin my first cousin was mm-hmm. walking on the other other side of her, and I looked at her like so. Say you were you you were Federica. Yeah. My yeah. cousin was on the other side, uh, and then I I looked at her and I was like, um. I just sort of like when when Federica turned to look at her, I just winked at my cousin, and then she and then I was like, yeah, we call it hmm, and and then 
Uh, and then my cousin was like, yeah, yeah, we, d- we do. And then we looked at each other. We just half smiled. And then Federico was like, oh, okay, okay. And then she, we walked. We went into another store. Um, White House Black Market or something like that. Yeah. yeah. Walked into <laughs> another store. Um, went to the Apple store uh, after that. And then eventually we circled back to where the H&M was. Mm-hmm. And, or the hmm, where the hmm was. And we came to the hmm. And, uh, and then... Federico went to my mom and was like, I can't see. I would, I'm I'm going to go look in the hmm. (laughs) And my mom was like, what? Looked at it, Federico. And and she was like, I'm going to go and look in hmm. And then she was like, uh, original pranks. And and, and my my mom looked at Federico and she was just like, Nicholas? (laughs) Just immediately looked right at me, knew it was me. And me and my cousin are dying oh laughing because we were hearing this and like w- we had like a church laugh going where we weren't letting it out yeah. and we looked at e- like just holding each other and just like, like oh my god. I just can't even oh my god uh it what's was going? just uh what's going on over here oh it's just said uh oh okay okay i paused a for a there. second I, I think we we had a blip there was something about sorry about that people there's like a one second blip there so feedback or something i don't know um, I'm sure it's fine. Yeah. Uh, we see this week. Let me make sure. Yeah, yeah. Is it still good? Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, it's you, still yeah you can still hear me? Okay. That's perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Oh awesome. my God. There's, a, there's even a metronome going oh. here. Wow. Well, you, yeah, I just turned it? it off. That's weird. It, well, I mean, you, you can't hear it in the recording. Yeah, yeah, there. obviously. It was just, uh, just for, so I guess you for know people. You can do that. Beep, boop. Yeah. Beep, boop, it, no, it was just beep. like, like a little one, two, three, four there. Yeah. Uh, you know, for all of the musicians out there. All uh, the musicians. This is, yeah. yeah, they already know about this. Why are we talking about But anyway, that's, talking to uh, that's, uh, yeah, so we, I convinced her, uh, that was called, hmm, yeah. and I have, it's, it's I have fond it, memories of that, like, because it's a harmless, yeah. harmless thing. Yeah, no, like, every time, and like, it was when I'm walking around here, and, like, people are walking up, because, like, normal, because, like, this is t- huge tour city, yeah. so you have people that walk up. And you're like, oh, can you like help me find like this place? And like, whenever I give somebody like uh, directions, I'm like, you feel yeah, so okay. Good. So what you have to do is like, you have to just like go down the street right here. When you get to lights, turn left. When you turn left, you're gonna see like a statue right over there. So when you see the statue, you're gonna have to keep going a little bit past that. When you get a little bit past that, you're gonna make a right. You're gonna go down. That's King Street. You gotta go down King Street a little bit, just like Hunter feet. You should see it on your left. I'm like, if I just told them like, oh, you just head in this direction. Like my, my directions are like so in like so, so much specific. Infor- yeah, so so specific. It's so much and information. I'm like. Do I'm you like, feel? Do you feel like like a man? I feel really. I feel really good giving them the information, and then I feel like afterwards, I'm like, I gave them so much information, they probably forgot it was too like much. halfway. It was too much, yeah. And I'm like, oh, uh, how they go on an adventure? And I'm pretty sure I've given like people like the wrong direction so many times, and I'm, I I think about the direction I gave them. I'm like, wait a minute, no, it was actually over on the other, the east side, not the west side. I'm like, oh, they're gonna have a they're gonna have a good fun. Oh, fun drive. that's I that. funny. I love, I do that all and the time. And like, you can't help them now. I it's can't. Like, no, I'm, I'm just sorry. Like, I just gave them. <laughs> I just gave him an adventure. You, you just say it in the in your head, just like I'm sorry. I'm like <laughs> I'm like Gandalf sometimes. I just get, I just send them on a path. Like this is the path you have to take. Like fly, you fools. <laughs> that's that's it. Fly, you fools. Oh my god! Have you speaking of flying? I had a hawk or a falcon. A falcon come and smack right into my uh, my window, like my neighbor's window. And I'm like I'm sitting over here playing video games, and like I'm like, what the hell is that? Okay. Um, I think it was like Far Cry or something. Okay. But yeah. What what console you got going? Is it 360? Yeah, or I'm on no? PC right there. Oh, just why do you have 360 games? Because I also have a 360. I don't play it anymore. Oh, okay. it's just, I just have it there for like a dis, like um. Aesthetic. Like, uh, yeah, aesthetic. Mm. Yeah, just decoration. Like I don't. Play you it. posh bitch. I know. <laughs> I just have it there for show. Like, come on. I I don't know if you can tell, but uh, in this bathroom, there's like, what would you say? Like 30 skin products. Just lined up like he has like, like yeah. lotions like okay. labeled th- with each body part like you, like yeah. you have a foot one you have a, you have w- mm-hmm. what is like the under eye cream you got the yeah. you got the moisturizer yeah if you don't then like why aren't you taking care of your body but like w- but why do you have the foot cream and then the ankle cream well for my Wh- butthole like <laughs> it's good it I, I, guess, I guess like, it's the same type of skin like ankle ankle flesh and and like the 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 rim right it's the same right? kind of consistency I actually had this one doctor he was trying to give me like foot cream for for like my butt and I'm like why like he's like oh yeah, it does the same thing I'm like for like, like 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 for like the like, chafing yeah like a chafing and I'm like why like well, I don't want this foot cream it's is like, this like the um 
is it like the what's that spray that the gymnasts use to like like so that the, the, their things don't ride up yeah yeah oh I need that Mm. But I'm just like, why is he giving me foot cream? Like, and Do it's you, just like sketchy. You like, don't have. You're not a. You're, you're not a uh, a beefy thighed man, are you? I'm not. It just looks beefy because so my I'm pushing so my legs down to make it seem like my yeah, legs are so actually Yeah, so you don't fatter. you don't get the thigh chafe in the middle, right? Uh, not really. Like, like so, like I, I I have to like make sure that like I have I, I wear like boxer briefs because I can't oh, wear yeah. like anything loose because like I need oh, like no. I need the I need the things constricted because like yeah. my thighs touch that they they oh, run together. I, honestly, like I have like, like I, I, have... I don't I don't have leg hair here because like the skin has rubbed the oh, follicles so... off. <laughs> so like there's like, these weird oh, smooth sweet. guys. If you're wondering. Um, if you're wondering just about his you genital need to area. know more about me. Um, there's smooth, uh, smooth there, on there's, the side, there's, there's but smooth, you have a nice good landing. There's smooth sections. The landing bush. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it. You know, like those, those, like you see those, those like tiles or whatever in uh, on the sidewalk with the bumps for like the yeah. blind. Oh, okay. This is for the blind. It, like it, it lets them know it's like, it, like when you when you've hit the smooth patch, you've gone too far. Like the, yeah. this is this is where they know to stop at the like, at the lights. Like mm. this is it, like this is the intersection. Yeah. Right. Like when you, it's like you need to get the green light to go past there. Oh okay. So ah, just, you're just, it worked. It you're, worked. You're just letting. I was like, talking until it made sense, yeah, guys. You're just I, I was. The know, like, this I is, was spinning a yarn. This is how you navigate my uh, city. So uh, like you have to go to the sea tower. That is a great. Tower right in the that middle. is a great. Uh, I don't know well, vernacular. At least, yeah. yeah, at least you have it now, so you can use it. That's great. So, um, I gotta head out soon. Yeah. I mean, about like f- five oh, minutes, gotta pack yeah, up here because oh. we're. Uh, I gotta go see your brother. Yeah, yeah, we're we're gonna get to that. We'll talk about uh, where we're performing this week. So, yeah, um, I'm gonna grab. I don't even I'm know gonna if I'm gonna, gonna grab have my phone. Tonight, so. I'm gonna grab my my, my pony over here. Yeah, okay, just I I'm still in. Oh, you have it written down. You don't remember. Well, no, I have my my calendar. I want to see what what, what we got on the old uh, on the on the where, on the old where Dickery can we dog see, here. Where can we see Nick Fernandez? Do you guys oh, want to see him? Oh my live? goodness! Um, well, I have in the Toronto. I, I am so Dell, famous GTA. that I have nothing booked this week. Oh, perfect! So, so um, you, I, you will somewhere. see me at your local open mic. Um, for the days that I want to uh, to go, get out there, yeah, guys. Check uh, out I mean, some, I'm, check I mean, out on, Thursday, on Thursday, on um, Thursday, I'm gonna brag about myself a little bit because I feel good about this. I got a, I, I'm, I'm yeah, auditioning right for there. the uh, yeah, Second City uh, Conservatory program. Wish him good luck for that. Um, you know, I, 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 I hope my yes and uh, comes together that day. Uh, I'm, I'm that I'm very yes and very anding. That's good. Um, and that every, but um, I, and then after that, I get to go see Tom Segura. I'm very excited. Nice, nice. That I uh, sounds like a great week. Yeah, I mean, like, he, his podcast is also a reason why I want to start my own, because, like, I love your mom's house. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and I love his stand-up, so, yeah. I mean... Yeah, that's why I'm, I, doing, I, that's why I'm, I'm doing this I'm podcast. going with someone who's not a comedian, yeah. so that I can enjoy... I could try and enjoy him not as a comedian. Yeah. Because I don't want to... I just want to go there and enjoy it. I don't yeah, want to... I don't want to... I don't want to analyze it. Yeah. I, I don't... Just like, I don't want to... I don't want to go bananas, comedian. like, trying to figure out yeah, how he's doing things. Turn off your brain and be like, no, I don't I don't want to think about it. I'm going to have a few drinks, relax. Just go there as uh, a fan. Yeah, yeah, I find that so hard to like with the work that I do because I'm like I turn movies into 3D. So like looking at any movie, I see like all the details in every movie. I'm like, ah, oh, just want to turn this off so I can enjoy. But are the movie. you enjoying the job? I am enjoying the job. It's actually a That's lot great, of fun. Man. Just working on it's great, all man. these features. I, I mean, I, I I'd love to find any job right now because I'm on the job hunt. Yeah. Um, you if hope. you're watching this and you like me and you like <laughs> you want to get your coworker Nick Fernandez a job. send me an email. Yeah. yeah. Uh, outside the party at gmail.com. Yeah, and, uh, and uh, what's uh, your Instagram? Handle, so my Instagram know, handle is at, at Nick Fernandez Comedy. I have it in the uh, graphics, so actually I made a little graphic. Right, it'll be it'll probably be somewhere around here because right. lo- no, the logo's like over here. Oh, so it's, a, it's gonna it's, be like it's it, gonna be a okay, graphic you know what? that pops up over here. I, I'm gonna give you a lot of options. You can you can freeze frame at any point. It's, like, no, there's no options. I already have it. No, like I don't know, like wherever it is, I'm like you could freeze frame and whatever. That's oh. it. This is me. Oh That's, wait, like that. Um, no, just point in that direction. I'll do it like right here. Oh okay. Oh, this is fun. I like that. Yeah. Um, yeah and, so, yeah, uh, follow Nick. You can follow me at uh, It's Jeremy Fisher. It'll be in the same location. Is that well. your name? Jeremy Fisher. I thought it was uh, John. John? Yeah. John Fisher. Well, John Fisher, everyone. We're such good friends. We're such good friends. Yeah. See, even Fisher, like, right? Maybe, yeah. PH or? Oh. That's ridiculous. That? Yeah. Like you're fishing. Oh. But with an ER. Wow. Like Fisher. Yeah. Yeah, it's very exciting. I actually and, just uh, I just made out you, 
I made it out of the blue. Like I you just chose I, that. Yeah, and well, like I put like a bunch of names on Facebook, and I'm like, this was this was like seven or eight years ago. I put a, a post on Facebook. I'm like, uh, guys, I want to change my name to something. Like I wanted a stage name. Like I chose like these names. Like what do you think is the best? Mm-hmm. And like the list of names was like Reynolds, King, um, um, Bond. Fuck, I like I just did like a whole bunch of like like uh, funny uh, like like names that you would already know. And then mm-hmm. I had Fisher up there too, and a lot of people like pick uh, like like Fisher. And I actually got Fisher from, like, Sam Fisher from um, Splinter Cell. Did you ever play Splinter Cell? You chose that. Yeah. You chose. I chose my name. Mm Because you know what? This is 2019. You can choose whatever the hell you want. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's, it's, uh, it's great. Yeah. It is great. um, Guys, you can find me at uh, the Old Sod tomorrow. I'm going to be performing there. Um... I will post something on the Instagram as well. Oh, do you know what? I I do want to promote a date. Is okay. um, uh, come out uh, September first to oh, Archibald's Pub in uh, in Richmond Hill. Oh, it's an amazing the show. Um, I, I've I've heard that um, there will be um, a couple of really um, really good comedians there. Uh, you two headliners. That I, I'll be there, but I'm talking like. Guys that have been on TV, guys oh, okay. that are that are that are up that, there, that are up there. Yeah. guys that when I see them on stage make me feel inadequate. Um, so I, I don't, <laughs> but it's and okay. I, I don't want I don't want to put their names out there. I, I want to, I want it to be a surprise. So um, come on out to that show. It'll yeah. be a lot of fun. Michael yeah, Primiani puts on. Uh, shout out to Michael Primiani. Put on, it's on a great you have to show. Pay for it. No, it's okay. it's free. They they do put out a bucket and ask okay. to, you to drop it's a whatever show. you want. Bucket shows. Um, you know, if you I, feel generous, like it's nice. Give, so give a couple, give a couple of bucks or whatever, but that's up to you. Only if you feel like you deserved yeah. it. Um, you know. Yeah. Like, we need you there. We need we we need you. We need an comedy. audience. To, well, yeah, go support live please. comedy. Please. What, what else are you gonna do on that day? Please. Like, please. I'm sorry. It's just, I really doing it right. I, I just I I have a little strategy. Dude, you know, like you know. I, if you could not, mock, like I just, I, I, I want, I, I, I just want my art to be appreciated. Like my, appreciate. I want us to be Wait, able to say our not, poem. It's not even your art. It's someone else's. You just want to watch their art. <laughs> you so much about someone else's art. I put so much effort. Um, so I got, some, like, I got some real tears going, man. You got me going. This is real. He's a real. He's a real. All right, right, guys. Thank you. Uh, Thank Thank you for uh, tuning in. It's Bananas episode two. Is that the name of this? Yeah. And we said bananas so many times. Did you know? I did. You know? I I didn't know. I said it in the first episode. You weren't here, so you wouldn't know. (laughs) You're just never gonna let me live that down. (laughs) Jesus. Guys, thank you so much. Uh, Stay tuned. Maybe we'll have Nick back up here again if he feels like doing it. Um. Can 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 I like give you your sign off phrase right now? What's my sign off phrase? We're just going to peel out. Oh, that's awesome. We're just going to peel out, guys. Have a good one.